Most coaches think that they will make six figures creating a low cost product that they will sell to hundreds of people. And I get it. We commonly think that if we sell something cheap, especially if our audience is small, more people are likely to buy it and it will eventually add up to big bucks. But it's easy to fall into that trap of thinking that cheaper is the better and the safest way to go. I used to be a part of a nutrition MLM business where I marketed a nutrition coaching program that included protein shakes where the MLM returned me anywhere from 79 cents, yes I said cents, 79 cents to a $40 profit per person that I coached one-on-one. -on -one. And I knew in the back of my head that there was a better way and that there had to be a better way and that I was a macronutrition expert, but I was so afraid to create my own product and charge my worth that I barely made $1,000 a month as a coach. Here's the two things that I did after I spun my wheels forever and eventually invested in a coach. So first, what I did was I created a signature product that solved a problem. After discovering macro-based nutrition and learning how to combine science with behavior and lifestyle and activity into a comprehensive custom program and refining the skills necessary to effectively tell my story, aka marketing, and coach clients to results and keep them coming back month after month after month, I was finally able to match and now exceed my full-time salary and my job before as a research laboratory scientist, making multiple six figures a year with my signature product. The solution that my signature product solved was weight loss and I delivered. In my macro mentorship program, I teach my coaches how to create a signature product by helping them excel in macros, and it results in them getting a macro nutrition certification by the end of my program. And then the second thing that was like the key to building my six-figure income was knowing how to appropriately price my product. You don't have to price low because other trainers or fitness coaches are pricing low. I'm going to say that again so it sticks. You don't have to price low because other competitors who are also trainers or health coaches are pricing low. I thought that too, and many coaches still do. I actually began with a $20 macro nutrition program that was underpriced, and it resulted into me taking on as many clients as I could for what I thought they could afford. Not what I was worth, but what I thought they could afford. And all the work was, the work was like really fulfilling. I was feeling overwhelmed, burned out, and underappreciated, and my clients were not sticking around for the long haul. It was eventually evident to me that clients that pay more pay attention, period. When they invest, they actually were getting better results. How many $20 ebooks and guides do you own that you don't or haven't ever used? Do you get what I'm saying now? So what this might look like is actually charging more to work with fewer dedicated ideal clients that actually get results because when they get results they're happy you're happy and the business continues to grow does, does that make sense so let me ask you do you really want to have 50 clients at a hundred dollars per month each just to hit sixty five thousand dollars for the year or are you someone who wants to create a signature product that gets people real results and you're able to charge what you're worth so I invite you to grab my free fitness coaching pricing guide that will help you get clear on what to charge for your services as a health coach, nutritionist, or personal trainer. This is actually the ultimate guide to help reduce self-doubt and improve confidence in the pricing of your fitness coaching services. Swipe up to grab it today.